name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. My adorable Jesus, may our feet journey together. This saint is called the Padre Pio of the East. Who would that be? Exactly. It's a bone from St. Charbel, the Padre Pio of the East, and he has as many miracles as Padre Pio on the other side of the world. Did you hear about the story about the lady there in Lebanon not too long ago who had the terrible tumor in her neck in St. Charbel? Anybody hear about that one? Isn't that incredible? Oh my gosh, she had a huge tumor where she could barely breathe. And the doctors were afraid even to operate on it because they said that she could actually die in the operation. It was that huge. And to cut it and to pull it out, they said, you could actually die. We can't really take responsibility for this. I mean, we will do it if you want us to. You have to sign the papers, though. We're not responsible. So she signed the papers to get ready for the surgery. And she went to bed that night. She loved St. Charbel. He's from Lebanon, and she's from Lebanon. She went to bed that night, and she, she had a dream. And in her dream, she saw, lo and behold, St. Charbel, whose bone is right there. She saw Charbel in her dream. And he leaned over in her dream, and he touched her neck. And she said he was doing, like, surgery on her neck with his fingers doing surgery with his fingers. She woke up from the dream and felt different. She felt lighter. She felt better. She touched her neck and the tumor was gone. She ran to the mirror. Not only was the tumor gone, there were stitches there. Is our God great or is God great? Is that amazing? The bishop testified to it. The bishop testified to it. Hallelujah.